Hello guys, this is Ice Multimedia and I am your host Tushayman. I recorded this clip for a music video. As you can see, I have recorded this clip with Sony FS700. This is a cinema camera and here you can see this is log footage and it looks like black and white or very, very less color. So what we need to do is color grade this footage. When we color grade this footage, as you can see, this looks very good and very professional and look amazing. So. So today I'm going to show you how to color grade your photos like this. So let's get started. Hello guys, this is Asmat Media and I'm your host Tushar and today I will show you how to color grade a log footage. First took your footage to the timeline, then select your footage and this footage is for a music video so I don't need audio part so I'll link this part and hit delete button from your keyboard. Now your audio should be gone. Now here is a fresh clip. So now let's play it. Yeah that should be fine. Now select your footage and go to adjustment layer. We need adjustment layer because we can apply all those effect to the all of the clip with single click so now drag your adjustment layer above the your footage or all the clip so now select adjustment layer and go to color panel because all we need to color get in color panel now what we need to do increase our contrast so here <clears throat> first of all I need to, we need to see in lumetri scope then we can uh, increase our contrast from here but we're not doing this because a lot of things a lot of time to explain I need so let us skip that now open curves and RGB curves now uh, choose white color and play with this color like me uh, follow that lumetri scoop that's going to change because if we go higher than 100% it will be solid white and if this color is below zero it would be uh, solid black so we cannot see anything there so what log footage try to do is just increase our dynamic range by compressing their color they push up shadows and they compress highlights so it look like black and white film and it took as much as dynamic range keep as possible so here we have to play with RGB curves like this uh, anyway this is basic correction uh, I need to do a lot of correction a lot of uh, individual color we do uh, basically when we edit a music video or a uh, drama or short film or something like this but uh, I wanted to show you very basic okay so here our RGB curves is done now we will work with color well so mid tone is generally our skin tone it, uh, it need to be a little bit warmer and highlights is uh, white so let's opposite uh, blue and shadow also a little bit blue so it will give you a color uh, contrast so we al you also can uh, shadow a little bit uh, pull down and mid tone a little bit pull up it will make uh, more contrast more color contrast and black and white contrast your uh, video will be look uh, very uh, realistic and very vivid color uh, high saturated color you can uh, make it more saturated but that will do for the leg and you also can uh, play with correction color will uh, color temperature or something like that but uh, we don't need to do it uh, for now so we leave it here so this is our uh, basic correction you also play with different uh, settings but for now this will do now let's a little bit down the shadow it will give some more uh, contrast you know we need high contrast and all color will be very good and you can see this footage is very good than before so uh, we just made few difference you need to learn a lot about color uh, but this will do for the next time so let's export our video for now and yeah we can uh, set a default YouTube setup and recommend it 8 Mbps so this was uh, 
so today was this tutorial so i will show you in the next time so take care of yourself bye bye